Today we reveal how savvy entrepreneurs are transforming air travel into lucrative opportunities. Uncover the incredible story of a jet owner who cracked the code of efficiency through the power of social media, funding his journeys effortlessly. And stay tuned for an exclusive peek into how private jets can even take you to new heights when it comes to reducing your taxes. Now, before we dive into the nitty gritty of turning a jet into a cash machine, let's address the elephant in the room, the cost. Owning a jet is a hefty investment. To put it in perspective, let's consider the costs associated with a mid-size private jet, such as a Cessna Citation Latitude or a Hawker 800 XP. The purchase price for one of these jets can range from $15 million to $25 million or more. But with the right strategy, this investment can be more than just a lavish expenditure. It can be a smart financial move. How, you ask? Well, let's start by exploring the concept of chartering a jet. Consider a jet sitting idle when it is not being used. Well, here's a cool idea. Why not let the owner make some money by leasing it out? Start by figuring out when the jet is available, set up some competitive rates after checking out the market, and make sure all the legal leasing agreements are sorted. When it's time to spread the word, think about joining aviation forums, getting on social media, and networking with fellow aviation enthusiasts. Here's a real-world example that'll make anyone smile. A private jet owner decided to lease out their bird during weekends when it wasn't being used much. And guess what? By leasing it for 40 weekends a year, they pocketed over a million dollars, covering their costs and making a tidy profit. What's more, they call chartering the Airbnb of the skies, and for good reason. You see, it's a goldmine that can help ease those hefty jet ownership costs. Jets demand a lot of TLC, and chartering can be a financial superhero. On average, each flight hour of chartering can haul in around $1,200 to $3,000. The exact amount depends on factors like the jet's size and where it's heading. That's some nice pocket change, right? And speaking of costs, let's not forget about fuel efficiency. Light jets like the popular Cessna Citation CJ3 are where it's at, especially now with fuel prices on the rise. Chartering one of these fuel-sipping wonders can really amp up income, with estimates of $3,500 to $5,000 per flight hour. The math is simple. Fuel efficiency equals more profit. So if someone is eyeing the chartering game, these nimble and fuel-savvy jets like the Cessna Citation CJ3 are the ticket to success. But it's essential to realize that chartering, although a great option, comes with its own set of challenges. After all, trusting others with a prized possession isn't always smooth sailing. There's wear and tear to consider, and the more flying hours a jet accumulates, the more it can affect its resale value due to depreciation. So finding that perfect balance between earning through chartering and preserving the investment's value is key. Now let's explore another avenue to monetize a private jet that's worth considering, like leasing the private jet to a flight school. Think of passing the torch to the next generation of aviators while enjoying a steady income stream. One can start by researching flight schools, whether they're in the region or spread nationwide, and get in touch with them to discuss potential leasing arrangements. Of course, it's crucial to ensure that the aircraft meets all necessary safety and certification standards. Safety always comes first, and when sitting down to negotiate, be prepared to talk about lease duration and compensation. Here's a mind-blowing tidbit. In the United States alone, there are approximately 3,000 flight schools that cater to over 300,000 registered pilots. That's a solid demand for training aircraft, right? By leasing the jet to a local flight school, one could potentially pocket a consistent monthly income of around $10,000. Plus, it'll be helping those aspiring pilots live their dreams, and that's a pretty cool feeling. Now let's switch gears and talk about a laid-back yet fantastic option, creating an aviation community through a flight club. For the first step, one can start with some laid-back market research to see if there's a demand for such a club in the area. And of course, make sure all the right licenses and permits are in place to play by the aviation rules. Next, create a slick website and set up shop on social media to attract potential members. The goal is to make joining the flight club as enticing as a first-class ticket. 
But here's where the fun really begins. Develop a membership structure with different tiers. Offer exclusive flight hours and discounted rates to make it irresistible. And don't stop there. Plan regular club events, flight training sessions, and laid-back social gatherings. This builds a real sense of community and gets everyone buzzing about the flight club. And here's the kicker. Flight clubs are riding the wave of aviation enthusiasm, especially in the United States, where there are more than 300,000 registered pilots ready to spread their wings. In fact, an annual revenue of $180,000 can be generated even with 50 members paying a monthly fee of $300 each. That money can cover operational costs and even leave a bit extra for the fun stuff. Next, let's transition to the next step in turning the jet into a money-making machine, leveraging it for advertising opportunities. So first things first, you'll need to secure the necessary certifications to make this dream a reality. That means becoming a certified pilot with a commercial pilot license and obtaining an aerial advertising endorsement. These qualifications can be obtained through flight schools and FAA-approved training programs. Whether it's installing banner towing gear or ensuring passenger comfort for scenic tours, this step is all about preparing the aircraft for the exciting journey ahead. Once the jet is good to go, it's time to figure out where to advertise. Think high traffic areas like crowded events, beachfront destinations and bustling city centers. These are prime locations for banner towing. Plus, consider partnering with local businesses looking to spread their message in these hotspots. It's a win-win situation. But how can the owner price the services? Well, that's a crucial step. Competitive rates should be set, taking into account factors like flight duration and banner size. Don't forget about offering package deals to entice local businesses into long-term partnerships. If curious, let's look at some real-life success stories. Take Jet Ads Inc., for example. They transformed a Learjet into a flying billboard and partnered with beachfront resorts during vacation seasons. In just one summer, they hauled in over $100,000 in revenue. Impressive, right? Nice. Now, let's switch gears and chat about the exciting world of social media and how one can actually make some money from it. It all begins with creating content that's not only easy on the eyes, but also grabs people's attention and keeps them engaged. Think behind the scenes action, breathtaking aerial shots and informative commentary. And remember, consistency is key here to keep the audience hooked. As the social media following grows, one will want to engage with their fans by responding to comments and collaborating with fellow aviation enthusiasts. Building a loyal fan base takes time, but it's an investment that pays off big time. Once a solid following is established, consider exploring sponsored content opportunities. Reach out to aviation-related brands for partnerships. They can showcase their products, provide in-depth reviews, or even promote their services in exchange for some lucrative compensation. Now let's not forget about advertising revenue. As the channel gains more views and subscribers, platforms like YouTube will start rewarding content creators with a slice of the ad revenue pie. That means more income coming their way. And last but certainly not least, merchandise sales. Design and sell branded gear like clothing, accessories, or aviation-themed souvenirs to the dedicated fan base. You see, there's Jet Setter Aviator on YouTube. They turned their aviation passion into a full-blown career, sharing flight adventures and amassing a whopping 500,000 subscribers in just two years. This led to some impressive sponsorship deals and booming merchandise sales. And when it comes to private jet ownership, there's more to it than just the thrill of flying. One can actually leverage some pretty enticing tax benefits thanks to specific IRS codes that allow for significant deductions. The first step here is crucial. Consult a tax professional with expertise in aviation tax laws. They'll help navigate the complex tax landscape and maximize deductions. What's more, one key advantage is depreciation, where a portion of the jet's purchase price can be deducted over several years. If the jet is used for business purposes, expenses related to those flights, like fuel, maintenance, and even pilot salaries, can be deducted. Plus, depending on the country's tax laws, there might be eligibility for bonus depreciation, resulting in substantial tax savings right out of the gate. So we've learned that owning a private jet can be more than just a symbol of luxury. It can actually turn out to be a pretty savvy investment if approached with the right game plan. It's all about finding that sweet spot between personal use 
and the potential for making some serious income. Understanding the market, matching the jet to one's needs, and exploring different avenues can make an investment soar to new heights. Thanks for joining us here at Opulent Oasis today. If this video was both informative and engaging, make sure to hit that like button and subscribe. There's plenty more content coming your way, all about luxury living and smart investments. And hey, while you're at it, don't forget to check out our other jet videos too. Until next time, keep soaring high and living that opulent life.